Hello crafters, you are watching Craft Capades 25 Days of Christmas Crafts. It's day 9 and I'm repurposing some jars to make my own candles. First, I'll start by painting my jars. I'm just using regular chalk paint for this. Now this will take several coats of paint to get the opaque look that I'm going for, but if you like the brushstroke look, it would only take a few coats. Finally, on the last two or three coats, I started dabbing the paint on with the sponge to add some texture, and I'm really digging it. I'll go ahead and paint my other jars, and then we'll start making the candles. I bought a package of these candle wicks at the craft store, and I just need to secure them to the bottom of my jars with this double-sided tape. I'll center my wick with this wick holder that came with my kit, and now I'm ready to melt some wax. I picked up several candles from the dollar store to melt down and use in my jars. This one smells like cinnamon. It took about 30 minutes for each of these candles to melt down completely to where it was ready to pour. I ended up using two and a half of these cinnamon candles to fill the biggest jar. I'll pour any leftover wax into another glass jar to save for another day. Now I'm moving on to my vanilla scented candles. Please remember to be super careful when working with hot wax. It is like lava hot and it's so easy to get burned. One vanilla candle was just enough to fill my smallest jar. I'll just recenter my wick here. I didn't have any more wick holders, so I just used the old school stick method. Two melted candles later, and I'm ready to add the final touches to my jars. Once the wax has completely cooled, of course. For this candle, I'm adding some ribbon accents using my hot glue to secure it down. And then finishing it off with some touches of berries and holly, and a little pine cone. I wanted to keep my other candles a little bit more simple, so this one's just being wrapped with some vine, and this one with some baker's twine. And then I wrapped some twine around my fingers several times. I pulled the loops off my fingers and then tied it around the center to make this cute little bow. I just love the smell of candles burning at Christmas time and I hope you are enjoying our 25 days of Christmas crafts. Subscribe for more! Thanks for watching!